Hey, my name is Lindsay Wright, and I'm actually going to be telling you guys a story that pertains to my life. Um, a little over nine months ago, I had began having a lot of dreams that I was pregnant. I was actually sitting in chemistry class when I had overheard a lady telling a friend she had just found out she was pregnant, and she didn't even know it. So, being that I had a weird feeling I was, I rushed out of class early to get a pregnancy test just for the heck of it. Um, the on-campus housing I lived in had a gas station type store on the first floor, which is where I immediately rushed to in order to get a test. And being that I knew it would probably be a cheapo, I didn't think it would come out positive anyways, but I was super wrong. Within the first two seconds, like, it turned pink as fast as can be. I was nervous and shocked. I rushed to Walmart to buy three more. Each of them gave me the same results. And I then called my boyfriend. First thing I said was, this can't be possible. Um, I have to graduate first, and as excited as he was, he just reminded me, you know, what's done is done, and we could only move forward from there. So from then on out, we couldn't wait for her to come, and just seven short weeks ago, I gave birth to um, the most precious little girl ever. Her name's Aria. Um, although I wanted to be graduated before I started a family, she taught me how to be strong regardless of the situation. I feel like um, having her can teach not only me but everybody else the importance of letting life take its course just because um, we may not have something planned for ourselves doesn't mean we can't embrace it and learn from it um, I've always been dedicated to being successful in life so having her has given me even more of a reason to shoot for the stars I don't just want to be successful for myself I want to succeed for her and I want her to be proud of me and she taught me a lot of things, but one of the major things she's taught me is she's made me more aware of the way we as humans tend to judge people. Um, as long as she's being cared for and is loved and content, she could care less who's holding her and who's feeding her or bathing her. She's not full of judgment. She doesn't want one person more than another based on their looks or their actions. And that really makes me realize that regardless of how someone looks or the way they act, they should be treated with equality and respect. Having Ari has definitely made my life better in many ways, and I'm sure many more to come. I wouldn't change being a mom for the world. She's made me a better person inside and out, and she's helped me to learn to be selfless, taught me responsibility, but most of all, she taught me how to love unconditionally, and nothing beats that. Although not everyone has children, I believe the moral of the story can apply to everybody else, and that's that life doesn't always go as we plan, but it does happen exactly how God has planned and there's always good that can be found in every situation as long as we don't focus on the bad we might be able to see the beauty in life so that's my story and I'm sticking to it thank you for listening